Welcome to the New Market Delta. I want to show you how to do the most common things within the software. Probably the first thing once you log into the application is just knowing where to look for a symbol. So if you click more under the more button, you will find a symbol search. Opening symbol search will allow you to search by symbol or description. Searching gold will bring up all the contracts and equities that have gold in the name. If it's a red background, you're not enabled for that data source. If it's yellow background, it's delayed. And if it's a white background, you do have data for it. Note the volume column. You can see which contracts or equities have the most liquidity. To change the symbol for a chart, simply type it in the bottom left hand corner of the chart. So for instance, if I wanted to change here to crude oil, CLE, press enter and it'll change the chart. All charts and in fact all windows are tabbed. So you can open up multiple tabs with different symbols, different chart types, different time frames so that you can quickly jump back and forth to see the markets. To change the interval of the chart, click in the same area in the bottom left and just type the number. So for instance, I'm on a 30 minute. If I want to go to a 10, just type in 10 and press enter. To go to a daily chart, press comma D and press enter. To change the chart type, you can use the chart type buttons to change between the different chart types. All the toolbars are contextual based on the window you have chosen. So I'm on a chart right now, so I see the chart toolbar, which is customizable. If I were to click the dome, you can see it changes to show me the toolbar for the dome. To add a study to the chart, you can use the studies that are on the toolbar, and these would most likely be your favorite studies, or right-click the chart and choose Add Study, and choose from the list or search within the search box. To open a new chart, right click on chart, choose add chart, and choose the chart type that you want to open. Once you've built the chart the way you want, if you want, you can easily just click the icon and replicate the chart, and then change the symbol to another symbol, and that's one easy way to replicate charts after you've built them. Software comes with over a hundred pre-built pages for you to select between. However, you can right click and say new page to have a blank canvas and then you can begin populating it using the black buttons in the top left corner. So clicking chart will open a default chart. You can open trading screens under the trade menu and everything can be customized between colors, rows, columns, Anything you want to change, simply click Setup and either System Preferences or Trading Preferences. So if I click Chart and then choose Setup, there's my chart colors, fonts, chart preferences. For anybody using footprints that might want to change the interval of the footprint, right click on the footprint and choose Modify Footprint, choose Source and specify the source type. So bar would be your time bars point figure would be your reversal bars and so on and so forth. So if I wanted a five tick reversal, just a one by five, apply, click OK. This concludes our short overview video of the New Market Delta. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to CQG customer service 24 hours a day or reach out to Market Delta. Thanks and make a great day.